25 7's Jim Piddick reports. Until recently, very few people had ever heard of the aptly named town of Hope, Texas. But that all changed when Richard Kilman, the school superintendent here, came up with an innovative, some say reckless, scheme to combat the problem of teenagers drinking and driving. No amount of education or legislation uh, is going to stop high school seniors from driving under the influence. So, so I devised the Teenage Wasted and Driving Program. Applying the same principle that security companies use by employing former burglars as consultants, Superintendent Kilman hired Mike Harris, a multiple DUI offender, to run the program. Mike's been sober for more than two years now. And in my view, well, there's, there's nobody better qualified to instruct our kids to drive more safely when they're impaired. Students, start drinking. This program's a, a good example of what makes this country great. You know, I'd probably have my hands cut off or, you know, other stuff. If I was from like Iran or Belgium. Don't worry about the cones. Just keep checking those mirrors. There you go. Good. These cones are too small. Bobby, go stand next to that cone. She ain't gonna hit you. Look, take a beer with you. I wish that more schools ran programs like this. Everyone knows the leading cause of automobile accidents are cell phones, old people, and Asians. Yeah, drunk teens are way down on the list. They're like eighth or ninth. If you start feeling the whirly birds, or if you're feeling out of control, think a sobering thought, like uh, some scary movie, like Kramer versus Kramer, where the little kid falls off the jungle gym and smashes his face. But Kilman's program also has its critics in Hope, Texas. I mean, it's well and fine for teenagers to drink. Yeah, I get it, I get it. But in the privacy of their own home, that's why I started this protest group, Fathers Against Reckless Teenage Activities. How are we going to make our ticket quota if teens know how to drink and drive safely? You're going to have my biggest joy and my everyday job is pulling over a drunkard, getting his ass out that car, touch your nose, walk yep. the line, count backwards, say the alphabet backwards, leaving out all the vowels, you know. People do have the right to criticize, but, but the facts speak for themselves. I mean, the number of teenagers dying or getting grossly disfigured or even slightly disfigured in car accidents it has dropped 400% since the Teenage Wasted and Driving Scheme, the Teenage Watt program began.